Hello and welcome. Absolutely ideal weather for football here in Manchester at the Etihad. My name is Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester City up against Manchester United. Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the greater desire? It should be a cracking game, though. Well, not many would debate the point that Erling Haaland is a joy to watch whenever he's out there on the pitch. But what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, we know he's a good all-round player, but his strength is when balls are rolled into him. He can hold up the play, he can roll defenders, he can get away from them. And that's key to the way his team want to play. When they get the ball into him, that's when they're at their strongest. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson is the goalkeeper. Joao Cancelo starts with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Dami De Gea begins in goal. Jadon Sancho starts with Anthony out wide. And the centrepiece of the attack is Marcus Rashford. This should be one to savour. Manchester City get the contest underway. Foden. It's with Gundogan. Bruno Fernandes has it. No possibilities in the centre. Eriksen. Well, if truth be told, he made it rather straightforward for the keeper. Well, he knows it. That is a real waste of a great opportunity. Laporte. Holland. Promising looking ball. Holland. Now Walker, Holland, and blocked for now, and delivered by Bernardo Silva here, giving it a try, well the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. Well they're certainly getting closer, you just sense that the goal is coming, they're playing so well at the moment. Foden. A terrific pass. We wonder who was going to win the race. The answer, the goalkeeper. De Bruyne. Oh, it's gone in! A derby goal, the first of the contest. Electric. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. So on they go again, and that really should shake up United. Can they find a response now? Bruno Fernandes. The ball with Rodri. Walker. Kevin De Bruyne. 
Holland. De Bruyne. On to Holland. Well, inching towards the break and City in front here. Stuart, as always, very keen to get your assessment as regards their performance. Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. Gundogan. De Bruyne now. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. Oh, a nice looking pass. And now the goal the City fans wanted to see. It's hard to see them throwing this away. Well, let's just take another look at this pass from Haaland. He has so much vision. And then this is a top-class strike from De Bruyne. His technique is absolutely spot-on. Just look at the power he generates here. <laughs> Half-time. That will do it for the first half here at the Etihad. Well, it's no great surprise. We sort of expect the second half underway and United left with a real mountain to climb. And doing his opponent. Holland. Intercepting it intelligently. Tomane pressing high to win the ball. Rashford! Oh, wonderful goalkeeping! Well, you have to say, from that sort of distance, that's a wonderful save. Substitution, then. Let's see how it affects the match. Corner kick taken by Christian Eriksen. And did his job defensively. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, showing excellent vision. Still a chance. Wonderful tackle. Well, I still can't believe that didn't go in, Derek. What an incredible save. Wasteful from City. Now, what can they do from here? Holland. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. And a goal! Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. Well, the action underway again. So comfortable for Sis.
See, it's turning into a trouncing. Cristiano Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Ericsson. Malasia. Plenty of support here. And the cross here from Christian Eriksen. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. And Manchester City going to the bench. A double substitution here. Well, they fancy a short one. Ronaldo, is it going to be? Well, really fine goalkeeping, good diving stop. <laughs> Playing it short. And the cross into the middle. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. Phillips. Well, as we get close to hearing the final whistle, Manchester City dominant, Manchester City excellent. Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, clever passing and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. Ronaldo, targets available, cross comes in. And not cleared away properly. That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Coming onto the pitch, number 18, Kate Nero. And he's fired over the corner. On well, the corner, too close to the goalkeeper that time. And there's the final whistle. It goes into the books as a City victory. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent. Full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. And it's no accident that the cameras are zooming in, as they often do, on Kevin De Bruyne. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.